Yes, today at nine o'clock, a, wait, no. Straight out in Skegan Heights, Michigan, where the one 20 year old man was terminated from a job for dancing. Developing story coming straight out of Miss. <laughs> Can you see me all <laughs> Developing story coming straight out of Muskegon, Michigan. Completely viral. <laughs> yes, over the weekend that video went viral and it got back to the job. That's sad. We actually caught up with that 20 year old man, Cortez Bridges, and this is. We caught up with. Wait, what? A... Damn, I just had it. Developing. <laughs> Developing story coming straight out of Muskegon Heights, Michigan, of a 20 year old black man. Fired from his job for uploading a video that went viral over the weekend. That video got fuck, 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 fuck. You want to get in my video? No, no, yeah, you can get in. Cause look, no, look, listen to me. It's sad. I had beef with. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> Losing daylight. <sighs> you should have. Wait, no. Wait, what the fuck? What is I try to do a video? I want to start making noise. All right. <clears throat> <clears throat> It's the very sad and tragic story. Did that sound good? <laughs> he thought everything was a joke, but officials at the company said, fuck, I was just making shit up. <laughs> I was trying to- I'll be having brain farts. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <You're> stupid. <laughs> <laughs> He took everything a joke, but he stop that shit over. Okay. Calm down. Breathe. No, I, Breathe. I just don't got like no script, so it's just like me freelancing. It's a very sad. It's a very sad day here. Somebody like that? Oh, come on. Everybody know you got fired now because you loud. Come on, go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I see the little girl doing it too. Good. People are here looking at me and shit. Richard, I'm ashy as a bitch. Richard Earl here with Now Say It Ain't So News. Back to you, nigga. Wait, I wasn't looking at the camera. Say It Ain't So News. Back to you, nigga. How do you feel? Wait, okay, so let me stand right about Make there. Make it more white. Make it more to... white. Honestly, can you believe everything that's happening right now? 20 year old Alexis Fietcher was actually. No. The same thing. Yeah. Although he said he doesn't give a fuck and he's just waiting for the next opportunity. Cortez actually wants you to share this story. So, wait, what did that? What did I just say? Although he said he didn't give a fuck. Cortez actually wants you to share this story so that you're prepared if you decide to post a video on social media. Although he said he doesn't give a fuck, he just wants you to be prepared. Back to you, bitch. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm working hard out here in these streets. Come give a nigga a job, because I surely need one. Come here. Don't look at the camera, look at me. <laughs> Go, scoop, scoop. Come here. Come talk to me. Hey, hey. I have to put the microphone to your mouth first, okay? 
how do you feel about Cortez Bridges being fired from his job? I honestly think it's some bullshit. You know what? Because that's his lifestyle. If he want to dance on the motherfucking company time, he can. Cortez said that it wasn't on company's time and they were actually about to leave. It's whatever he said. Okay. I actually need you to back the fuck up now. <laughs> Richard Earl here reporting live with Now Say It Ain't So News. Back to you. Fucking bitch. Yes, um, actually I've been through, I actually went through the same thing just a couple months ago. Um, they tried me like I was some type of fucking, no, it just made me feel like, yeah, and I, to I totally agree with Cortez. There was nothing wrong about what he did. And I feel like if you can't live your best life, then where the hell are you going to live it? Thank you. I mean, people got to see what you fucking do. People got to see how you are. I'm messing with nobody. I ain't even, wait a second, it had happened, but I don't even mess with anybody, I don't even, I don't say nothing, I don't, I don't say shit, so shit like that, like, I'm not that fucking bitch, like, I won't come up and hit you with that stick, then just, thank you, but yeah, they didn't try to leave the situation alone, they, they wanted me to take my video down. Which I did because this is the job I have for right now. But we're in this thing, public school. Are we done? Thank you. Developing story coming straight out of Muskegon Heights, Michigan, of a 20 year old black man fired from his job for uploading a video that went viral over the weekend. That video actually got back to the job and he was terminated immediately. We actually got a chance to catch up with him and this is what he had to say. First of all, if you had beef with me at work, you should have had beef with me at work. Why would you wait until I get all the way home to tell me I'm fired? That's sad. It's a very sad and tragic day here in Muskegon Heights, Michigan, where 20 year old Cortez Bridges was terminated from his job. Although he thought everything was a joke, the company did not. Company policy states that uploading a video while on company's time is an automatic offense and will get your ass dropped in minutes. This is what he had to say about the situation. I'm not mad or anything. I'm more so disappointed because it's like, you know, I just work so hard. You know, I come to work every day. I'm never late. I never call in or anything. And so for y'all to just drop me like I'm a bad habit, that just speaks volume for what type of company you guys are. So, the same thing actually happened to 20 year old Alexis Fietcher. A couple months ago, she uploaded a video on Facebook and company policy stated that she would either have to be fired or sign a paper stating that she would no longer post videos while working. This is what she had to say. I actually went through the same thing just a couple months ago. Um, They tried me like I was some type of like I wasn't that I, to I totally agree with Cortez. There was nothing wrong about what he did. People gotta see how you are. Um, I had the same thing happen to me just a couple months ago. They came at me with some Like, damn Lex, what are you doing? You're in the back, you're on the clock. First of all, I am living my best life. I, I'm not messing with nobody. Wait a second. They wanted me to take my video down. I could definitely relate to Tez, you know what I'm saying, because the airport tried me too, you know what I'm saying, they're going to fire me because I'm over here leading by example, doing the right thing, the examples, you know what I'm saying, leading by examples that they said when I started, they're going to try me like I'm just some fun and shit going to fire me because some fat penguin head ass bitch over here shitting all over the facility, you know what I'm saying, I'm just trying to keep things running smoothly, you know what I'm saying, but it's crazy though, because you know what I'm saying, it's like they don't even think what financial hardships they about to put you through. When they want to fire you, you know what I'm saying? Now, how about I come back through the internship and fire them? You know what I'm saying? But I can't do that. Cortez actually had that job so he can raise money to move to Atlanta. But it doesn't seem like he's going to be using that job anymore. I was actually working there just trying to raise money so I can move to Atlanta to follow my dreams. 
But honestly, I really don't care. Honestly, can you believe everything that's happening right now? <laughs> honestly, no. It's like, I, I really just cannot believe this. It's like, I, I, I got so much mother go out of me that'll make me kill Fuck you. I don't care. I'm gonna be me all day. I don't care where I'm at, who I'm with. It doesn't matter. Can you do that one dance that you went viral for doing? Hey, Katie. <laughs> Richard Earl here reporting live with Now Say It Ain't So News. Back to you. Now say it ain't so. Fucking bitch. Are we done? Thank you.